Hey guys, it's me, Dion. What you thinking? Okay, now it's time to react to um, Rogue One, the Star Wars story. And I cannot wait for this movie to come out. I know, I'm literally so serious. Um, I love all the movies. I actually have all the movies on DVD itself for Force Awakens, which my nephew has, by the way. Um, the reason how I found out about this trailer that just came out, my nephew had told me. Hold on. Let me show you something real quick. Cool. Does it mean by my size, do you? Yep. Yoda. Yoda! Um, anyways, yeah, so I can't wait for this movie. Thoughts about this. Well, yeah, thoughts. Hopefully, this movie will be good as Force Awakens. Not better. Good as Force Awakens. I absolutely love that movie. It's it got some minor, minor, minor issues, but that movie is fantastic. Uh, right, go buy that movie. Go buy it. Go buy it. I'm actually wearing a Star Wars hoodie. Guess what this is. Guess what this is. Okay. There we go. One, two, th you know what? This dumb cat. Get down. One, two. Three. Last Studios. State your name for the record. Jin Ursa. Forgery of imperial documents. Possession of stolen property. Aggravated assault. Resisting arrest. Oh, what? On your own from the age of 15. Reckless, aggressive, and undisciplined. This is a rebellion, isn't it? I rebel. The man may fight. A major weapon is imminent. We need to know what it is and how to destroy it. Your star. Is that clear? Yes, sir. What will you do when they catch you? What will you do if they break you? If you continue to fight, This past year has been an amazing one for Star Wars. Not only did the fans help to make The Force Awakens a global success, they've also helped to raise over $10 million on behalf of Star Wars Force for Change to date. Okay, enough of that. Um, wow. Oh, hold on, I'm going to have to try to cut, split that spot. You understand. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. This movie was good, but... Uh, cringe because it's like it's gonna be amazing oh my god I am fanboy in the crap out of myself yep I'm really him I'm really him fanboy in the crap out of myself because this movie looks amazing all right let's talk about this whole entire trailer uh, originally my nephew was supposed to be right here but he's not here I was gonna do a review of this but I can't I can't do it how am I supposed to do it with just me talking let me just talk on this camera. Okay. First starts off is Rogue One, as you can see. <laughs> Alright, so it's just a, about a girl that's like Jason Bourne in a way. It's like she's on the cover of stuff, even though she's not on the cover. She's killing stormtroopers like it's nothing. Bop, bop, and you, you see this pop, and then you see pop, like a wah, wah, wah. And you see pew, 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 pew. Yeah, you see a lot of that. And um, you see this guy, and then you see Donnie Yen with the tour two things. I didn't know they had ninjas in Star Wars, but they had ninjas, and it looked amazing. Ouch. It looked very amazing! 
This is so awkward. But yeah, so this thing looks amazing. Um, the cast looks good. Nothing wrong with the cast. It just feels like the Star Wars. This is a Star Wars dream come true. I actually want to see more of Star the Star Wars story. They advertise it so much to the point I, I'm like, why don't they have more? I know they have like animated cartoons and everything. Like, I used to watch the cartoons Clone Wars. Um, they had this other one. I forgot what it was. But they had so many cartoons, and I love Lego Star Wars, the game. Mm -mm. Can't wait till that one that's coming out in June. Um. Yeah, I, I love a lot of Star Wars related crap, you know? I, I love it. I I have hoodies, I have shirts. I had the Millennium Falcon shirt. I even had a Kylo Ren shirt. I love every single thing about Star Wars, and there's nothing wrong with that. The only thing I don't love about Star Wars is that Star Wars Battlefront, you know what I mean? I miss the old ones, the PS2 ones with the days where you could actually go in space. Start shooting a lot of things. And this reminds me, Rogue One reminds me of Battlefront because they are like that. They are like top secret and stuff like that. They on ground shooting. They don't have no lightsabers. They have a ninja. But uh, that's, that's besides the point. This looks amazing. They grip. It's like Guardians of the Galaxy. In a way, it's like Guardians of the Galaxy. You have like these kind of outcasts. They might be outcasts. Who knows because they didn't watch the movie yet. Um, Peter, the girl was like Peter Quill, you have like the whole dynamic duo, you have the ninja, that's, um, dang it, don't get mad at me because I forgot her name, I, I really did forget, the green girl, I forgot her name, oh um, yeah, god dang it, I forget her name, um, we got Groot, I don't know if the personalities, well, most, it should be personalities changes in this, and when I seen in that last scene in this trailer, wow, this is gonna be big. I mean, this is something that I always wanted for years. Even though I was born in 1998, I, I love Star Wars. I like I said, I literally have every single DVD of them. Um, you know, that's pretty much it about this one. I absolutely love this trailer. And I can't wait till this movie come out. I wish they set out. Well, they said it's coming out in December, so it's not that far away. Cause time is going by fast as crap. And the weird thing is, it's snowing in March. That 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 doesn't make any sense. I mean, is it was it in March? No, in April. Oh my god. <laughs> but yeah, it's it's snowing in April. Wait, what what type of crap is that? I I don't understand. I wish I was in California. But yeah. Please like, share, and please like, share, and subscribe, and...